Hey, what's up, guys? Dude, long couch. Back in the house. Back on the stream. Time for more Shenmue 3. Also, my throat is pretty sore today, so I apologize in advance for that, but... I'm not gonna let that stop me. Because I want to play this game for like four hours tonight. Hopefully. <laughs> Thanks for coming out to the stream. How's everybody doing? Okay, so if you saw me on social media, you may know that last night they sent out a fix for the broken DLC codes. I got it installed. It's working. We have these things now. SD Chai. I guess that's a capsule toy. Capsule Ticket. Chained Fist, which I think is a move. Hawk Leather Jacket. Two-Wheeled Fist, which is another move, and a special phone card. Have all been bequeathed to me. I now have them in my inventory. So the very first thing I'm going to do is change this out. This sick Kickstarter exclusive jacket. And you know what? I think this would go really good with the red shirt. There it is, guys. This is what I've been waiting all game for. <laughs> That's so cool. It's the hawk jacket. It's a hawk fighting a snake, and it says Japan Yokosuka on it. Got a mountain in the background. Looks dope as hell. And I think it actually works really well with the red t-shirt. I like that a lot. So I'm a very happy long couch right now. And then if we check the new moves that we got... Um, none of these need swapped out, right? No, not just yet. So we got two wheeled fists, a technique that involves swinging both fists into a hammer knuckle uppercut that leaves you defenseless. Reward from Shenmue Patron. And then chained fist. Wow, that looks really cool. <laughs> a surging Wing Chun attack that hits quickly and involves chopping away at the opponent's body with violent rights and lefts. Reward bonus pack. Yeah, that kind of that kind of reminds me of the machine gun fist, and I love that a lot. I'm very, very happy to have that. Awesome. I can't wait to get some of these other moves maxed out so that I can use those. And then for items? Uh, a lot of these are listed as new because I haven't actually come in and looked at them in the inventory. So I'm not sure which ones of these are actually the ones that we just got <clears throat> in the from the DLC. It said SD Chai. These are the phone cards I already had. So that's not helpful. Some more phone cards? Did I really have that many phone cards? I guess I did. <laughs> they wouldn't be under key items, would they? Thunder Palm? Why is there a Thunder Palm technique under key items? I don't know, but here's the jacket. <laughs> That's a key item, apparently. Capsule ticket. This ticket allows you to get one capsule toy at any machine, no matter the price. One capsule toy at any machine. So I guess that's just a free spin at a capsule toy machine. Here's a special phone card. This is a telephone card for backers that allows you to make an unlimited number of international calls. So I guess this just takes away the need to have real phone cards. Awesome. Awesome, 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 guys. I don't know what SD Chai means. Let's look under capsule sets. Maybe we can find it in here. I guess I just got another one of these. I already have one. They should have given me the Rio forklift. <laughs> Anyway, so that's the breakdown. That's most of the Kickstarter stuff. Very cool. Very cool. When we left off yesterday... Why in the world did it take me here? That's weird. Hey, Philip, Welcome to the stream. How you doing today?
This is kind of a pain in the ass to navigate. I want to get to the end of the Nyawu section. Okay, I'm gonna close this and reopen it. Why is it bringing me here? That's so weird. You're on your second playthrough already? I'm still on the first one, man. But I might be finishing it out tonight, maybe. I'm getting really, really, really worried about spoilers. And um, <sighs> I'm very conflicted because I don't want to rush through this game, but I, I really want to finish it too. Like I kind of want to finish it tonight. And I think I'm pretty close to the end actually, just based on things people have told me and stuff I've gleaned. I think there's probably only a couple hours of actual story content left. Is that a fake Phoenix mirror that Ren stole from- Dude, he stole it from the shop! I was looking at that! <coughs> I was looking at that earlier! <laughs> like six streams ago, I saw that. Hey, that's awesome, Philip. Thanks for the support, man. Much appreciated. Get in the game, man. ダメだ。お前の考えに乗るわけにはいかない。け。まあいい。とにかく向こう岸に渡る船がいる。お前は船を用意しておけ。ああ。お前は。俺様にもちょっと考えがあってな。準備ができたら乗船所の2階に来い
This interior knee move seems like it's kind of crappy. And I will train it later if I can get to it. But for now, I would much rather be training chained fists. So that's going on there. I hit the wrong button. ええ、まあ、結構ですな。憲法を磨きたいと思ったらいつでもどうぞ。武神道の門は開かれておりますぞ。はい。すみません。鍛錬ですな。木人で訓夫を積むもよし。So I don't think anybody has received their um, physical rewards yet, Philip. But depending on the tier that you backed at, you should have a digital download of the art book. I downloaded mine, but I haven't actually looked at it yet. それならちょうど良い相手がおりますよ。赤老という修行者です。さあ、励んでください。Me too, Brownie. That was gonna make me cry. <laughs> okay. Uh, you know what? Let's max out lawnmower real quick. It's so close. And it's a good move. And it's very easy to do. So I can unequip it and then never have to worry about it again. Oh, so you did get your downloads? That's good. Um, <clears throat> for one of the tiers that I backed at, I'm supposed to get a voice message from Corey Marshall. And I don't know how they're going to like actually distribute that. It's just gonna like come as an MP3, or if he's gonna like call my cell phone, or what. But I really can't wait to get that. Oops. Wait, which one? This is the one I want. Change fist. Here we go. <laughs> Looks kind of neat. Stop kicking. There we go. Why am I not getting credit for that? I agree, he is a great actor. I've actually had the pleasure of, of chatting with him a couple times, and he's just a super cool dude, very down to earth. And he treats his fans great. Corey Marshall is awesome. Like, you can tell that he just loves playing the role of Ryo. He's just, he's really happy to do it. He's happy to do it for the fans. Just a cool dude. I love Corey Marshall. Alright, so I was trying to win... It was the, it was this thing I was going for, right? I think I got the violin. Let me double check myself before I double wreck myself. Where is it? Yeah, I need this for knee kick. Might as well give it a couple shots. Okay, we gotta get right in the middle, it looks like. Six bucks a pop, I can play this... <laughs> what? 400 times? Something like that? I should be able to win it in that amount of attempts. Oh yeah, that's, that's perfect. No, get back over. Alright. So there's a handful of things that I definitely want to mop up before we uh, continue with the story here. I'm not sure if I'm going to be able to do 100% of the things... <clears throat> here in the Awu, um, like all the Chobuchans and all that, because I think it's just going to take too much time. And I'm, guys, I've been so close to like having the ending spoiled for me like eight times already. I'm, I'm getting really paranoid. I'm thinking what I might do is I might try and finish the game tonight, and then I can. 
I can stream more of the game later on, like, so, you know, probably sometime after New Year's, when I have, like, some more free time. We can do more things in the Yowoo, try and, like, do more side quests and things like that. Maybe I'll keep a separate save file in case anybody would be interested in seeing that stuff on a live stream. But I think for now, I do have to move forward with the story with a greater sense of urgency than I've been doing up until now. Unfortunately, real life is just kicking me in the nards in terms of time. Well, Philip, some people are just douchebags and they don't really care about spoilers, so they just throw stuff out there. Sometimes it's just an accident because, you know, like I'm a member of like a lot of like Shenmue groups on Facebook. I probably should have left them all when the game came out, but I didn't. <laughs> so sometimes I'll be scrolling through my Facebook feed and I'll just see like, hey, what did you guys think about this part of the ending? And I like throw my phone across the room. Um, I haven't gotten hit with any major spoilers yet. Um, but like even YouTube got in on it. Um, I told the story the other day. I was on the main page of YouTube the other day. And this video popped up as a recommended video to me. It was literally titled Shenmue 3, uh, Final Boss Fight and All Ending Cutscenes. And like, I literally like threw my computer out the window. My whole desktop, I just threw it out the window. Literally. Um, so yeah, stuff like that keeps happening and I'm, I'm just getting super paranoid, you know? <laughs> I can't dodge spoilers forever. Get in there. You son of a bitch. That was so close. Ugh. I think the biggest things that I really want to take care of before we proceed trying to rescue Shenhua is I want to finish this move because this item is right here and I know I can get this move. And I want to go find that lady that we found all those shopping items for and give them to her. Because I went out of my way to get all the items, I might as well finish that quest, right? I just got to find the damn lady. You are not alone in your love, Philip. I love Shenmue more than I will probably ever love a woman, if I'm being honest. <laughs> Uh, this game means so much to me. And you know what? I've been thinking about when I do get to the ending of this game and I watch the credits roll and just how sad I'm going to be because there's no guarantee that there's ever going to be a Shenmue 4. So on one hand, I'm like, I don't want this to end. I mean, this is clearly not a perfect game, right? But it's Shenmue 3. It's a Shenmue game through and through. And uh, it's very special that we actually have it. So who knows if this will be the last time we get to play a brand new Shenmue game, you know? It very well could be. All right, go to the right. You son of a bitch. The right girl would probably love Shenmue more than you too. That's exactly right. <laughs> I like the way you think, Brownie. <laughs> I gotta find a girl who loves Shenmue more than she loves me. That's how I'll know that she's perfect. This is actually kind of a tricky board because you have to be in the middle. You have to get in the center when you're like halfway down the board or else you're never going to get in this little section here. And then even if you do get in it, it seems to always go to the left no matter what you do. Literally going to spend all day at this lucky hit board. I'm crazy enough to do it. Don't test me, Shenmue 3. I have an iron will, which you have cultivated. 
and I will use it to win this game at any cost. Over. Right! Right! Damn it! How does it keep landing on the left like that? We didn't get charged for rent again today. Because the game keeps starting us off with a cutscene outside the hotel. Oh, we gotta do the, the last of the phone calls, too. I hope I can remember which options I picked. <laughs> Because there's one more option for each phone call that we that we uh, we have to listen to. What is this? Like attempt number eleven? Ugh. Okay, 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 okay! Yeah! There we go. You've gotten enough of my money today, sir. Alright, where's the nearest pawn shop? Let me check the name of that lady. Oh, now it's going to the end of the notebook. Why wouldn't it do that last night? So it says, Ren tells me to give them a fake mirror, but that might put Shenhua in danger. I can't do that. Find a boat to take us across. Tell Ren when I find one, he's on the second floor of the ferry terminal. Okay. Oh, I forgot the reason I opened it in the first place. <laughs> was to check the name of that lady. Jing Ching Lan. I think. Now, she was like, she was out here somewhere, wasn't she? So, I want to say she was like out around this spot near the entrance. Ha! I was right. あの、全部変えたの。そろそろ船の時間なの。間に合ってよかったです。買ってもらった分を急いで生産しないと。ヘイ、<笑> Oh, that's it? I didn't get a reward for that, probably because I didn't get it the cheapest it could be. Well, why don't you do your damn shopping then, lady? Screw you. I don't even know you. You sent me off on an errand to go buy all this random crap? Some people, man, I'm telling you. Okay, let's go hit a pawn shop. And then, um, I guess we'll go do some, some phone calls after that, probably. Never did the fishing here, either. I guess I should do that. I wanted to spend, like, an entire day doing some fishing, just to see how much you can make. That'd be fun. Hoi, irashai. Uchi wa ryoshin tekina shichi ya anshin no kougaku kaitori desu. Setto de omotsu no shina wo koukan suru koto mo deki masu yo. Uh, what do you mean by the cheap items? I'm not sure what you are referring to. Setto nara ba こちらの素敵な品々と交換できますよ 
All right, let me just see if I have anything else to trade. Nothing with herbs. Oh, I could probably sell some herbs, though. Actually, not really. I could sell, like, one set. Whatever. I'm so close to completing some of these, but it's so hard. It's so hard, guys. All right, we'll take this. If I can figure out where to get... What is this? The Monk Gold Relief. I could get the back roundhouse kick, which sounds pretty cool. And then I need the big space fight. Yeah, I wanted to do this, too. Oh, the quest I just did for the lady. Um, I, I don't know. I just bought the items as soon as I found them. I didn't realize there would be, like, more than one instance of the item. Oh, look! I got enough phone cards to get ankle sweep. Cool. Mine. Did I say phone cards? I meant shop cards. Oh, and I can get flying spear. Guys, I've unlocked so many moves that I didn't even know it. That is awesome. Meowwoo Chinese food set? Liquor Heaven is what it says on the card. Oh, yeah, that's the name of the set. So, okay, where's Liquor Heaven? I gotta go find that one, and then I'll get Heel Kick. And then for other sets... I still need that blue dragon base. I haven't found this anywhere. Hey, what's up, uh, Sal... Salkio? Sorry, I'm not sure how to pronounce your name, but, uh, welcome to the stream. And yes, the prize sets are kind of a nightmare. Like, specifically, the capsule sets are so freaking difficult to get, it's not even funny. That's an electronic shop. I mean, like, I've spent literally hundreds of dollars in-game trying to complete some of these capsule sets. And I, I guess it's just the rarity of the the capsule sets, um, the, the capsule toys themselves. Like, the most rare one must have, like, a 1 in 1,000 chance of dropping, because it's just ridiculous. Say Ocean, gotcha. Cool name, man. Does that mean anything? And yeah, I guess I did fail the quest. Like, I got her all the items, but she wasn't happy about the price, and she didn't give me any kind of reward for it. So, I assume that's a failure. <laughs> what is that? Lonely Potter. I think I already checked here. This seems like the kind of place that would have that dragon base. But then it doesn't. Uh, nope. Yeah, I did have a lot of money, but then I just had to pay $5,000 for the reverse body check move scroll. So now I'm pretty broke again, actually. Alright, I think that Liquor Heaven might be... on this road here? Let me look up here first. Specialty goods. Blossom Direct. Oh man, I think I tried to find Chobuchan here for a while and I could not find him in there. Sayoshin is a musician band? That's cool. I've never heard of them.
Soul of Buddha. Shaolin Supply. There it is, Liquor Heaven. I was right. It's right here. Oh man, I'm almost out of food items, guys. I'm gonna have to stock up on that before I go to the castle. That'd probably be smart. Look, there's a back to the shop. What's going on back here? Okay. What? <laughs> you can step off of this ledge here, but you can't step back on it. Okay. Not a problem, just kind of weird. Alright, let's get down to brass tacks, guys. This is one show which I am not leaving behind. the area I can't go back in. Oh, I'm way further than you are? Uh, <laughs> well, I I'm not sure how far I'm going to get tonight, man, but from what I understand, there's a good chance I'm actually going to beat the game tonight. So as much as I appreciate you hanging out on my stream, I'm not sure if you want to be watching this. But if you would like to check out some of the earlier gameplay I did, it's all archived on my YouTube channel at Dude Long Couch on YouTube. Please feel free to go check it out. I'm actually getting like crazy excited at the thought of finishing the game tonight. Like sad at the same time, but also like getting hyped. Like, oh, this is what I've been waiting 18 years for, you know? Like, I, I feel like I can't even focus on this search for Chobuchan right now. It's like my body's pulsating with desire for Shenmue. I probably spent more than three hours total trying to find all these Chobuchans, but I have found some really difficult ones too. I found the one in the the Muren Cafe, the wooden dummy cafe, and it was pretty awesome because somebody came into the stream like just to ask where it was, and I was like, I don't know, man, I haven't found it yet. But I'll tell you what, I'll go look for it now. And then I got there and I literally found it in like 30 seconds. It was crazy. And it was a difficult one too. Okay, so this one's not anywhere obvious. We need to start getting a little crafty here, I think. You guys don't suppose he'd be outside behind the shop, do you? Could be. I know that they're not above putting him out front. They've done that at a couple stalls I've seen. Especially because there's merchandise out here. Like, I think if there's merchandise outside, it's fair game. Especially since you bought merchandise. Yeah, Murren Cafe was really hard, and uh, Chobu 1P was really hard. That is a different shop. 
Chobu 1P probably took me the longest amount of time so far. And it made me feel really stupid, because once you actually find it, it doesn't seem like it should be that hard. Like, it actually seems fairly obvious. <laughs> but damn if it didn't take me, like, over an hour cumulatively, probably. Yeah, exactly, the clothes shop. You know you've been in here for a while when the music fades out. <laughs> Sometimes they do like to stick him behind the counter where you can't go. This stuff's pretty far back, though. Anybody got any ideas? Yeah, are you able to give me a clue without directly saying? That'd be cool. at eye level, not up or down. Okay, thank you. Oh. <laughs> nice. That was a good hit. A uh, good hint. Thanks a lot. Alright, that's that out of the way. So now, um, <clears throat> since I'm right here, I'm going to stop off at this shop and I'm going to do a couple spins on this capsule machine because I just need this one last plate. I've been trying to get it for so long. It's the crane and flower plates. And also, I have a free token that I can use on these, but I don't know how to use it. This looks like it's going to charge me cash. Do I just use it from the inventory? Oh, I've actually got 20 of them. Dude, that's awesome. I'm 
don't know how to use it though. Yeah, the Miruka. Gurupa no Chiketo Tskaka. Okay. Just that's good. Good uh integration there. I like that. Really? You spent an hour trying to do this and still didn't get it? I've, I probably spent, I don't know, maybe 10 minutes before, and then I gave up, and I just keep coming back every now and then. Is this the kind of thing where where it's not even in here? Because it should be in this machine, right? Yeah, the odds must be like one in freaking eight thousand. How are you gonna spend an hour at a machine and still not get it? Like, come on. グルッパのチケットを使うか。I think I've only gotten one rare one so far. I don't even remember what it was, really. Uh, maybe from the Shenmue 1 set? I think I got, like, one Ryo in the forklift. And then I traded it away, so I don't even have it anymore. So my Twitch dashboard is kind of freaking out right now and saying that there's nobody watching the stream, which I don't think is correct, because people are still talking in chat. Are you guys seeing a, like an issue with the stream or anything like that? The stream itself seems to still be up. It's just saying that nobody's watching. Which I don't think is the case. Oh, so it's saying the same thing for you? Okay, well, I, I guess I won't worry about it then. <laughs> Hey, you guys are still here. Uh, Twitch is probably just having some issues or something. I better not count against me in the metrics. <laughs> if it tells me my if it tells me my average views for this stream was zero, I'm gonna be upset. <laughs> That's not true. I'm spending all these capsule tickets here, guys. I don't care. I want this stupid plate. And I might as well use them. You know? Oh,これは。グルッパのチケットがあったな。使ってみるか。なるほどな。グルッパのチケットがあったな。使ってみるか。Okay, that's it for uh, <laughs> the capsule tickets. Philip, when you were done trying to win this, how many of all these other places did you have in your inventory? Was it like over a hundred of all of them? Because I feel like that's where I'm heading right now. Oh, 
れは面白いな。One more. This is the last time I'm ever trying this. Okay. You know what? I'm taking that as a sign from the Shenmue gods that you're not meant to do 100% of everything in a single playthrough anyway. <laughs> oh, jeez. I would like to find some of those other prizes, though. Like that jet fighter plane thing? That's got to be at one of those smart ball arcades. It should be up this way. Um, yeah. You save before spending all your money and continue the game from that save. That's smart. Yeah, save scumming is a uh, viable tactic, I guess I would say. Oh, you know what? They have a lot of stuff at the prize exchange over here. I wonder if that dragon base is there. Or the other thing I'm looking for. Because I don't think I checked for those specifically last time I was here. This lady's like a robot. I don't trust her. Oh, let's see. We got a power shovel loader yellow. <laughs> That's not correct. Missile destroyer. Big interplanetary bomber. Big fucking bomber, guys. That's not the right thing. Nope, we don't have what I was looking for here. But we can get the corn dumb, which is supposed to be one of the best values on the return of your money. I really want some of these other clothes, though. Like, I don't even think I would really wear this, because I already have the sickest jacket imaginable. But I just kind of want to see how it looks on him. So pricey, though. Stonewash jeans. Do you guys think I should get these stonewash jeans? They look kind of gaudy, but maybe they'd look good on Rio. Who knows? And they're relatively cheap compared to some of this other stuff. Oh my god, it's the hotel lady. <laughs> Why did they make more than one shirt with her on it? <laughs> What's so special about her? Oh man. Yeah, I don't really love those jeans either. You know what I might get, if I could remember where they were, I might get the ripped up jeans that have the holes in them. The black jeans look good. Do you remember where they were? Maybe at Chobu 1P? <laughs> <laughs> oh look, there's capsule toys back here. Toy cars and chairs. Chairs. Guys, listen, you know I love this game and I love Yu Suzuki and I don't want to talk shit, but why did they think that chairs would make a good capsule toy set? That's like one of the most boring things I can think of. <laughs> yeah, I thought that the red shirt would look really good with this jacket, so I changed out of the, the hotel lady shirt. <laughs> um, where is Chobu 1P? I just want to find some clothing shops. See if I can get some jeans that look halfway decent.
Uh, might as well stop off in here and exchange that move. Still not the X button to open doors. I'm never gonna get used to that. Yeah, imagine how I feel trying to uh, navigate this game. You think the black jeans didn't suit Ryo? Um, yeah, I don't know. They they might not. It might look good with this particular jacket, though. Did you try it with this jacket? What was I exchanging? Is a was it a prize set? What did I get? I can't remember now. Oh, I forgot they had clothes on the other sets, too. Wait, why can't I look at this? I can't zoom in and look at this closer. Lame. Heel kick, that's right. Okay, got it. Ah, Warukunai Torihiki Dana. Kokan Surumonga Sorota Ramata, eat to them Okinayo. Yeah, I want to try it with this jacket. I think they might actually look okay. Honest trend fashion. Need us say, eat Jacado Day. Oh, wow. Pink polo shirt? <laughs> uh, this isn't equipable stuff, though. Which is too bad, because if I could wear this pink polo shirt, guys, I would never wear anything else ever in this game. Rest assured of that. Oh, I see. The ones that have that are on like a little stand inside the little picture of them... Those are equipable. The ones that are not on a stand are not. I see. Oh, that's pretty cool. <laughs> that's cool. Yeah, I agree. The ripped jeans would probably look good, too. It's going to come down to whichever ones I find first, I think. <laughs> Obu 1P was down the stairs. And these aren't clothing shops up here. Okay. Frame rate's running a little rough today. Probably should have rebooted my PC. I haven't done that in like a week now. I'm not used to having to do that. Like, my, my PC is fairly beefy. And I generally haven't had to reboot it very often, but ever since I started streaming on Twitch, I've had to reboot it more and more because it turns out it's pretty intensive to stream. Hi, hi. There they are. Damaged jeans, and they're a thousand dollars. So I can't afford them anyway. All right, we're going to fix that. Can you guys imagine paying $1,000 for a pair of jeans that are ripped all to hell anyway? Yeah, I, I, that's... <laughs> come to think of it, that's probably the number one thing that I wanted to do before I left for the end game is I want to make sure that Rio <laughs> looks really cool. I want to have him having the wardrobe that I want him to have. And you know, it's funny because I have seen so much, I wouldn't say complaining, I would, I guess I would just say backlash from people in the Shenmue community saying that like, man, I would never change Ryo's clothes, you know, it's, it's, it's classic Ryo outfit or nothing for me. And I, on one hand, I kind of get that, I guess, but on the other hand, like, it doesn't bother me at all. I actually really like having the ability to swap out clothes for Ryo. He's still Rio. I mean, look at him. That's that's Rio. That's his face. <laughs> I think it's really cool that you can kind of 
outfit him the way you want. I think that more games should do that. I really love when you can change the way your character looks in a game. All right, let's see how much I can get for these tokens. <laughs> your grandpa sent around a collection plate because your cousin had ripped jeans. And he thought that she couldn't afford good jeans. That is hilarious. That's really funny. All right, so I can get seven of these. Bye bye, all my tokens. I hate listening to this lady talk. I really can't explain why, but it, it does bad things to my brain. It just feels wrong. All right, now it's back to a pawn shop. You like him wearing the story related items he wins? Are you, are you just talking about the clothes that you win? At like prizes and stuff? Gotcha. All right, I'm not sure how much money I'm going to get for all this corndom. But I'm going to sell them all. Um, there they are. Only 6,000. It's not a lot. I mean, it's a lot, but it's... Not as, as much as I need. So let's sell some other things too. Got a lot of stuff I can part with here. No duplicate skill books to sell. Should have a lot of duplicate freaking capsule toys. Though they don't sell for much. Sad to say. I was trying to hang on to like two of each of these, but I'm reaching a point where I realize it really doesn't matter. I didn't mean to select all these, and I don't think I can... Yep, I don't think you can go back on that without canceling everything. Wait, yeah you can. It's the X button. I'm an idiot. But now I know. Dang, these two? Like, even the more expensive capsule toys only sell for one dollar. That's just... That's just mean. No return on the investment, guys. Sorry, I've got a lot of stuff to scroll through here. <laughs> Look at all these plates. It's just absurd. cars too that was another one i was trying to get the wagon set for that stupid kid and his side quests and i couldn't do it no matter how many times i tried am i maxed out on being able to sell stuff okay why won't it let me do more than one of these What 
the fuck? I think this is bugged out a little bit. Or are these just not sellable? It won't even let me sell them now. There is one Chobuchan in every shop, but there are more. What do you mean more? More like outside of shops to find? Because if that's what you're saying, then no, I did not know that. That sounds ridiculous. How would you even know where to look? They're so freaking tiny. Yeah, I found one in the, um, I think it was the Leo Jang Martial Arts Hall. Which informed me that there were some at the Martial Hall to find. Because <laughs> I didn't even know that before. What I'm not sure of is if there are some in the arcades as well. I suspect that there might be. In fact, I think I did find some in the uh, the smaller arcades, like the smart the smart ball arcades. But I'm not sure about the larger ones. I want to see if I can do some forklifting today because that is by far the fastest way to make money I found in this game. Other than maybe collecting herbs. Nice. They are in arcades. Good to know. They must be really hard to find because those arcades are massive. Seriously, guys, on a scale of 1 to 10, how sexy is that jacket? Because I think it's like a 13. Same route as always, except this time we're doing it at night. Look at that, our forklift has headlights. That's a nice touch. Ooh. Arcade cabinet right up front. Don't mind if I do. We gotta go in this way. You realize you had more Chobuchans than the guides say there are. Interesting. Yeah, the guides are probably just not complete yet because the game's so new. I'm really curious about how much hidden content is in this game in terms of side quests that are, like, difficult to find. Like, if you think back to Shenmue 2, um, the duck races were a thing that I didn't know about for the longest time. Probably, like... It was probably a full year after I played it for the first time when I started seeing talk of the duck races on the internet, and I was like, what the hell is that? <laughs> And then I probed deeper, and I found out the whole thing, and I followed the guide, and I did it myself, and I was like, this whole thing was here in this game the whole time, and I had no idea. I did not mean to sit that there. Let's 
Is that like a special crate? Why is that a weird color? I wonder. It'd be cool if there were like different colored crates that were worth more. And you had to figure out how to like efficiently get those in your time limit. That'd be a... be a nice wrinkle on this. I like doing this at night. Yeah, it's a different type of ambiance to it. How do you know when you found all the herbs? I've traded all of the herb sets for all the moose scrolls that I can possibly get. But I don't know if I found every kind of herb there is to find in the game. Oh, trophies, right. Yeah, so I'm playing the PC version on the Epic Game Store, which does not support achievements or trophies, so... I haven't gotten any kind of indications like that, which is fine. I, I used to be kind of a trophy hunter, but these days I'm not really, so. And besides, I'm going to be playing this game a lot, you know, after this initial playthrough. Um, I'm probably going to play through it on PS4 in English, just as, you know, a different way to do another playthrough. So I'll get all the trophies when I do that for PlayStation anyway. And then I will, of course, buy the Steam version when that comes out in a year. Because I have to buy and support every single version of this game that exists. It's pretty much required. Why can't I raise this up? I guess you can't lift the vases higher than ground level. I, I don't know. Drop it, you some bitch. Thank you. Good man, Philip. Way to support the series. I did the same thing. I actually, I wasn't able to get an order in for the limited run games collector's edition. Um, I ended up, I, I was actually in very poor health back then when, the, when it went on sale and I ended up oversleeping and um, missing the moment when it went on sale. Which sucked. But I did get two copies of the Picks and Love Special Edition. I've got the Epic Game Store version. I've got the PSN Digital version. I've got about, I'm not even sure, four or five physical copies on PS4. Um, <laughs> including the Steelbook version from Best Buy, which I love. Like I got it right here. Check that out. Good and sexy. I still haven't even received my physical copy of the PC version from the Kickstarter because those were delayed. Which isn't a big deal because they just gave everybody download codes anyway, which is all that's going to be in the box. So it doesn't even really count as a, a you know another copy of the game, but I do still have that coming. Yeah, man, I was kicking myself because I really wanted that LRG version that comes with the Dreamcast case. 
which is like one of the coolest bonuses I could conceive of for this game. Just a Dreamcast version of the, the actual game case. Such a good idea. And uh, that morning came and I slept right through it. By the time I woke up, uh, they were all gone. And I cried myself back to sleep. I'm not going to have time for this one. But I already have it on my forklift. Just let me finish it. Man, that's rough. うちの旗場は厄介なのにノルマも達成して大したもんだ。今回は特別に色をつけとくぜ。ありがとうございます。また来てくるよな。ではまた。Well, since we're obviously not going to be able to talk to Shenhua, <laughs> let's do some more phone calls. I've been kind of holding off on those, and she's going to want rent money, too. Damn it, lady. Yeah. I've got, um... I've got Shenmue 1 and 2 on Dreamcast. I've got the remasters for PS4 and Xbox. There's the Xbox copy. Shenmue 2 on Xbox. Bought it day one, back in the day. Don't really like that version of the game, if I'm being honest. But it's fine. Okay, we're going to use our special phone card, guys. Reward S3 World Telecom. Cool. Okay, we've got one variation of each of these left. Let's just go down the list. Hopefully I can remember which dialogue options I need to pick because I did this like two weeks ago. I also don't know why they changed that. The password. Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazuki。Hazu
丁寧なことだなま親父には俺から伝えておこうああ頼むまた電話してこい暇だったら少しくらいは付き合ってやるああじゃあな We're totally bros now, guys. I love these phone calls. This was such a great addition to this game. Nozomi! ああ。ねえ、ハズキ君、聞いていいなんだ。ハズキ君も夢を見たりするそりゃ、まあ、な。どんなどんなって Guys, these are completely different options, aren't they? These are special... These are like different phone calls because of the special phone card. Holy fuck. Okay. Uh, well, we have to tell her that we dream about her, don't we? I mean, come on. We'd be very upset with ourselves if we didn't do that. Ah, so you have a mini... Harasaki got you many detecta. Eh? What does she got? Ah. バオチェカバオ。えっと、教室にいたな。教室学校のああ、俺が何か忘れ物をして原崎に貸してくれって頼んでるんだけど。うん。原崎も同じ忘れ物をしていて、二人で困っている夢だった。何それ変なの確かに
I can't handle it. Oh, God. Um, New Yokosuka Harbor. Actually, no. I'm curious about Dobuita, because he's never in Dobuita, so how would he know? Dobuita no show tengai wa douda. Minna genki de yatteru kana. Hai! Saikin ore mo bento yao tetsatterunde. Kono goro mo, mo Dobuita no kao sse ya. Goro ga bento yao? Ureru no ka shinpai dana. それにしてもスマイリーって花屋のゆりこさんっていい女っすねなにこないだ店の前を通りかかった時についミトルチマいましたよゴロなんすか兄貴舞ちゃんに代わってくれ今の話をいやー勘弁してくださいや兄貴マ
Uh, you don't like that I'm not playing in English? <laughs> Sorry. We took a vote when I started streaming this game the day it came out, and the vote came out Japanese. And I'm okay either way, so... So what would you say is the best fishing spot then, Philip? I hope this move is just like super badass once it gets leveled up. Well, Jock, you definitely don't want your phone to blow up, so you probably just stick to 480p then. <laughs> Although it's good to know that you could use that in a pinch. Like if you got attacked in your house and you wanted to lay a trap for the attackers, you could just start streaming something at 1080p, and then they'll walk in to kidnap you or do whatever they were going to do, and then they just find your phone, and then they get blown up. It's a flawless plan. Fishing spot next to the temple. Which temple are you talking about? There's a couple different temples in this area. Okay, Leo Zhao Shrine. Um... Crap, I wish I remembered the layout of this place better. Um... Let's... Go down this way, I guess? I think down here is where we rent the rod from. I mean, this way is nice because you can keep running most of the way. Oh, where that girl is? Oh, I think I remember that spot. It's right up here, isn't it? I just need to go rent the rod. So, are you talking about right down there off that dock? where we rent the rods from? Yes. Okay, cool. That's convenient because it's right next to this spot where I can rent the rod. Uh, what do I do? Talk to one of these guys? Okay, so this is the most expensive set. Apparently, this is worth it. I don't know. I'm just, I'm just gonna go with this one. See what happens. It's interesting. There's, there's different kinds of like uh, exclusive sets at different fishing spots, like or uh, fishing shops, and I just wonder if there's any real difference between them. Oh, 
All right, here we go. I've only done this once, and it was, you know, a while ago, so bear with me here. So we keep swirling R while we hold the opposite direction of the way it's pulling. Pretty basic. Common carp. Your favorite rod is the one at the market before this area. Well, hopefully the rod that I grabbed here will do the trick. I'm not sure if it's better to reel it in slowly or quickly in terms of like trying to hook the fish. The biggest fish you have was 800, 8,993 as in centimeters or the weight in grams. That's, it couldn't be that many centimeters. Sorry, that was a really dumb question. <laughs> That was a really dumb question. Is that considered large? Like, I just, I haven't done a lot of the fishing in this game, so I don't know. There's a big old bass. Catfish, that's, that's gotta be worth something, right? Catfish are worth a lot in Stardew Valley. <laughs> oh, so instead of reeling it, I should swivel it back and forth like this. Nice. Fifteen hundred grams. Getting up there in size. Is it worth it to try and hit like other spots? I can't really cast in any other spots, it seems like. I guess I just want to stick to like this deeper water out here. <laughs> Sadly not edible. Gotta be honest, I'm not a big fish guy. I don't really like any kind of seafood, which I normally get yelled at for. I really don't like the taste of crabs. Um, the smell of crabs actually made me throw up one time. That's a true story. Ooh, 5,500 grams. Shit, yeah. And, you know, um, I'm originally from the Pennsylvania slash Maryland area, which is really big on crabs. Like, Maryland specifically is known for crabs. So that was kind of heresy back where I come from. <laughs> I'd tell people I don't like crabs or fish, and they'd be like, dude, what's the matter with you? You're allergic to crabs? <laughs> hey, you know what? If you gotta be allergic to something, at least it's something gross like crabs. You kinda got lucky there. But hello, fellow Marylander. I'm actually, I'm specifically from Pennsylvania. That's where I live most of my life. And I lived in Delaware for about eight months one time, but you know. I ended up in Maryland a lot because I, I live very close to the Maryland PA border.
Brownie, you remember everything I've ever said. I saw your YouTube comment about the the dubious story. I can't believe you remembered that. <laughs> I didn't even remember that I talked about that ever, but you remember that I did. Oh, dude. I had a friend who did the same thing. Uh, like 10 years ago, I had a friend in Pennsylvania who moved to San Francisco, and he's been there ever since. And apparently he loves it there. Oh, uh, so I should alternate left or right of the middle? Okay, I'll, I'll try and do that. Thanks for the tips, everybody. Much appreciated. So I want to try going over here. I wasn't sure if it'd be better to just try and stick to like a, you know, the deeper water. You've got to keep reeling. So you want to reel and swivel left and right. That's the pro strat. I should not be looking at chat when I'm trying to reel a fish. Gotcha. So you want to reel in kind of slow. Oh, that, that does that does go faster. You're right about that. You know what? I, I'm enjoying this more now that I realize there is a little bit of nuance to it. I didn't pick up on that the first time I did it. But this is fun. And hopefully I'm going to make some pretty decent money out of it too. It's just kind of funny, though, because Yu Suzuki did actually say in an interview that he didn't think the fishing minigame was all that good. <laughs> this is the creator of Shenmue. He said this himself. I think his exact quote was something like, yeah, there's probably better fishing minigames out there, but we wanted to do it, you know? <laughs> I have not done the fishing side quest. I don't even know how to access that. Oh, I couldn't even see that guy. This fishing minigame is better than Yakuza's. I've actually never played a Yakuza game, so I'll have to take your word on that. I really like the fishing minigame in Okami, as I've mentioned. That one's great because it actually integrates with the in-game powers that you have. The Celestial Paintbrush. Like, you have to draw a line to the fish to hook it. And then you've got to slash it once it jumps out of the water. Like, it's just, it's cool.
ATT Perry Mason. Thank you very much. I appreciate that, man. And thanks for coming out to the stream. Just an FYI for anybody who has just shown up, I'm just going to be fishing all day today. <laughs> this is my little fishing experiment to see how much money you can make in a single day. I'm actually gearing up to get ready to go to the end of the game soon. I just need to buy like one last pair of jeans <laughs> to feel ready. So I'm trying out the fishing and I'm trying to make money. And then we have like five or six phone conversations that I want to do. And then we'll probably be heading for the end of the game. I wonder if different fishing spots have different music. That would actually have a huge effect on which spot I chose. The music that's playing here, I like it just fine. But if there was another place that had a track I liked more, I'd probably make a point to go there. Your seventh playthrough? Dude, that's awesome. Yeah, I'm still on my first playthrough, man. I, I've been trying not to rush it. I've been trying to do, like, as much as I can in the game. There's still a lot I haven't done in terms of, like, uh, getting all the prizes, all the move scrolls, finding all the Chobuchans. I'm sure I missed a ton of side quests. Um, I haven't played a lot of certain arcade games. I played a little bit of all of them. But there's more I could do. Uh, so I've locked out the fishing side quests. That's okay. Let's go back to the middle here. When you fish anywhere else, it takes longer to hook a fish and reel them in. Gotcha. I feel a sneeze coming on. Don't do it. Don't do it. Ugh. I think I fought it off. But it's going to come back to haunt me later. Because they always do, right? So, Perry Mason, without spoiling anything specifically, have you found any really cool hidden side quests that many people might not know about? Oh, there is a New Game Plus. Yeah, I figured there would be. I, actually, I think I think they talked about that during development. So I think I did know that. Um, you know, I just I wanted the first playthrough to be like really like as complete as I could make it and just be really special. And I'm probably not going to be streaming entire subsequent playthroughs. Like I might, you know, I'll probably load the game up and stream certain parts for people who want to see certain things. But, you know, there's about a million other games I would like to be playing on my channel right now, so I have to kind of split the time, you know? Also, fun fact, my controller's doing that circle-y light thingy, which means the batteries are dying. Hopefully it lasts through tonight. Yeah, that's kind of how I'm feeling right now. Like, Because I know that I'm very close to the end of the story. And I'm just like, man, I, I really want to know what happens. Like, I just want to do it. But I also want to wrap up this other stuff that I am interested in doing. It's, it's like a catch-22. 
It's a real Sophie's Choice, you know? If you're not familiar with Sophie's Choice, that term comes from a book about a mother with two kids during the Holocaust who had to decide which of her children was going to die and be killed by Nazis. So when you say it's a Sophie's Choice, it means that it's an incredibly difficult decision with no right answer. So, playing Shenmue 3 is exactly like having kids in the Holocaust, is what I'm saying. It's like the same thing. What? Oh, you don't get to go all day? I was prepared to go all day. We caught a lot of fish, though. <laughs> Uh, yeah, how many side quests are there in the game? $470? That's not as much as I was hoping for, if I'm being honest. Ten in Bailu, fifteen in Yawu. Yeah, I definitely didn't find all those. I think I found like maybe three or four in Bailu, and then maybe four or five here in Yawu. I'm not even sure. Crap, I don't even know like what to do now. I was hoping to make more money from that. Um, I guess I'll go do some more forklifting then. In the Rose Garden, you get three moves, and then every time you finish afterwards, you get ten snake power drinks. That's awesome. Okay. Maybe I'll go do some of that. I do need more food, though. Yeah, I figured that I could just rent another rod and keep going, but... I mean, the whole idea was to do one session. I wanted to see how much money you can make in one single fishing session. And now that has been answered for me, so... That's because this is a Kickstarter exclusive jacket. So you had to back at a certain tier, and then you got a download code for it. And it's just... Oh, I love it so much. It is the sexiest jacket that ever was a jacket. <laughs> there was actually a problem with the codes, and they just got fixed yesterday, so this is the first time I've been able to wear it in the game. How much food do I have? Not enough, really. To keep going in the Rose Garden. Um... Let's go see if I can get some... Oh, you know what? Can we get Black Onion from that prize exchange? If I can spend tokens on it, I think I'd rather do that. You should have gotten a, a DLC code for something at that level, the 250 level. I don't think it... I don't know what it would have included. I can't tell you that for sure, but I think you should have gotten something, at least. Game Center. Ooh, have I checked this one for that... That one... Plane that I need? Nope. That ain't it, Chief. I've got all those. I really don't know where to find some of this stuff, guys. That dragon base. I've been looking for that, like, ever since I got here. Which 
shops are down here. The bar. Oh, there's another pawn shop. What can I buy here? Nanja. あ、金に困っとるのか。わしもそんなにはもうかっとらんが。そういや、セットで揃ってるものをもっとったら交換もできるぞ。あ、you don't buy stuff at pawn shops. Um, yeah. We know that there's going to be story content. We don't know if it's, like, what the nature of it's going to be, but I'll definitely stream that when it comes out. Rest assured of that. Tadaima. 120 tokens. Okay. Um... How many of these can I buy? I think I'm gonna spend all my tokens on these onions, guys. <laughs> Garlic. I don't know why I keep saying onions. Lady, please never talk again. Please, I beg you. Okay. Let's, um... Let's head back to the Rose Garden. I, I did get pretty far there. I'm at the point where I'm fighting multiple people at the same time. Yeah, I'm generally impressed with the game as well. I'm trying to be objective because, you know, this is my favorite franchise. Shenmue 2 is my all-time favorite video game, and I waited 18 years for this, so... There's definitely a level of hype that can kind of cloud my judgments. If, you know, if I'm trying to be objective, it's not a perfect video game. The only thing that I, that I think really needed to be stronger was the combat system. I, I don't like it as much as the old combat system. I think it kind of lacks depth. It, it can still be fun, but I just really miss the old system. The Virtua Fighter fighting engine was just perfect. And it felt really good when you got good at it. And you know, it's, it's, it's rough in certain other ways, but considering the budget they had, I think they did an amazing job. You gotta keep it in perspective. Yeah, it's not good, but it's okay for what it is. And you can tell the love that went into making this. I mean, it's 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 a Shenmue game. This is Shenmue 3, for better or worse. And that's exactly what they wanted to make, and they did it, so. Okay. <laughs> Why would I want to start over? Oi, oi! Dare da kunna yabai futari o kumase ta noa! Chobu no saikyo kombi ga tsui ni tojo! Mo do na te mo shira ne zo! Kifuda ga nai na. Ma, kiga mui tara chosen shite kure. Oh crap! I forgot you need tokens to enter. Gogo sanji han kai shita. Ah! Oh, that's okay. I can buy some here, can I? Where's the token exchange guy? How many do I need? I can't remember how many I need to enter. 3,000 should do it, right? Oh, is the OST really that short? That does suck. Yep, I know all about the circle of life in this game. But you know what? 
it's not going to be very long until fans and modders just like rip the soundtrack from this game and upload it in really high quality. So. Oh, I just realized. Okay, hold on. I gotta back out for a second. Because these fights are really hard, and I have all my moves that I'm currently training right now. So I need to swap these out for moves that are actually good. Um, I should do that on two, shouldn't I? I really haven't even used the the different manual selections because it just seemed like it didn't matter. What do I want to use though? I know I definitely want that one kick move. Where is it? Thunder Palm's pretty good. Let's throw that on there. Four sided kick. Yes. Yes, you're big. Perry Mason, fuck yes. That is exactly right. That's my favorite move in this game. Um, if you if you check out the stream I did, like, I think two or three streams back, I definitely rung some dudes out with that move, and it felt amazing. Tornado kick, that'll work. Spinning back this, sure. Lotus Cutter, XXB, I can do that fairly easy, so I don't need that. Why? That's not that hard to input. Shinbone Smash doesn't seem great. Neither does that. Yeah, that's a good one. That's not exactly easy to input because it's three different buttons. All right. Okay. I think I'm ready now. Are they going to make me wait? Damn it. While we're waiting, let's do some roll it on top. Saikoroka. Domo, Domo. Wede yattari de gozaimasu. Mazua ikido yattimir de gozaimasu. Deva shobusuru de gozaimasu. Okay, I need 3,000, so I'm only gonna bet 50 here. Orega furu de gozaimasu. Wow, okay. I'll just go fuck myself then. Yeah, I'm at the point where I'm fighting two people at the same time. I'm not sure if I will get through this, honestly. Come on, let me fight. お、兄さんか。そういや、まだ名前聞いてなかったな。葉月亮です。葉月亮。亮。うーん。あの、何か。いや、兄さんの売り文句を何にしようかなって。結構です。<笑> Yeah, I don't know. Uh, the last time I did this, I I defeated a lot of people. And then I defeated, I think, maybe two or three rounds of the one versus two fights. And then the one that I'm on beat me. 
Like, the guys just ended up being really strong, and I lost the fight. I was like, okay, gonna have to come back later for this. You guys think there's a Chobuchan here in the Rose Garden? Wouldn't that be amazing? If there was one hidden here that nobody knew about. And I was the first person to find it. There is one there? Really? Wait, did I find it already? Did I find it, like, ten episodes ago and forget about it? I may have found it already. I'm not sure. <laughs> Anyways, here we go. ローズガーデンでも屈指の人間兵器が卓球を組んだぞ。さあ、無敵の波状攻撃を打ち破れるか。見物だぜ。エントリーフィーはこれだ。All right, I only get one shot at this. I did find it, Brownie. Thank you for confirming. I, I thought I did too, but I wasn't sure. I love that move. Wow, look how much damage they did to me already. All right. なかなかやるじゃねえか。俺勝った分だよ。イエーイ。おいおい、兄さん。本当かよ。まさか全部勝っちまうとは。これは玉毛だぜ。ほらよ。商品の技所だ。おわお。I Three on one is easy. Okay. Well, I hope you're right. Entry fee wa kore da. Only a thousand? Okay. Yatte miru ka. <laughs> that feels really good. Oh, you weren't kidding. You basically just button mash through this. Alright. おらよ。持ってけ。とんでもねえクソ度胸なのか。それとも頭のネジが緩んだのか。こんな最強最悪トリオと本気で戦うつもりなのか。エントリーフィーはこれだ。やってみるか。This is actually awesome cuz I can take these tokens and buy more corundum. Make a little bit of money that way. Get out of here, fake Tony. Oh, 
やばん。3秒揃った最悪のトリオが登場。心臓の弱い方はどうぞご遠慮くださいってやつだ。エントリーフィーはこれだ。5000 This is going to be a tough fight, isn't it? よし、やろう。Let me heal, please. Shit. Why wouldn't they let me heal, guys? Oh god, oh god. I need everybody to back off. Oh god, oh god. Using my snake oil. This move is perfect for when you're surrounded by multiple opponents. Dude, these guys are all tough. What the hell? Really? Get out of here! すごいな、兄さん。ほら、取り分だ。受け取りな。来るぞ。KO率3%のスリープラトン。I don't know if I have the Shinbo Smash trained up. This is the last one. Ah, uh, I I'm not I'm trying not to save scum in my first playthrough. I know that's like the smart way to do it, but I'm just I'm letting it play out naturally, man. Whatever happens, happens. Ten thousand. All right. I wish I had more snake oil. Should I buy some snake oil and then come back? That that'd be smart, right? Yeah. Okay. Uh, where's the best place to buy snake power? Can I buy it from anyone here? Oh, yeah, this guy over here sells it, doesn't he? Sumimasen. Oh, Nisan. Tyrek Kaifkuni, Utsina Manzu, do they? Yeah. Man, it's not cheap. But this is gonna pay for itself, right? As long as I can keep myself alive during this fight. I think five should be enough, right? Because I'll make that back with the tokens I make, more or less. Alright, wish me luck, guys. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. Oh, let me check out. You keep saying Shinbone Smash. I don't know if I have that one trained up. What is going on? My controller's screwing up a wee bit here. It's not letting me select the things I want. Well, this is annoying. All I can do is scroll through these ones. I can't actually, like, scroll through it for real because it's just not working on the controller. Whatever. It is what it is, man. Shenmue Gods have spoken. Get snake power for 240 in the chemist shop. That's good to know. 
Is that like the cheapest place to get it? Confirmed? Oh, hey, Perry Mason, thanks for the follow, man. I appreciate that. Entry fee wa kore da. Yoshi, yaro. Okay, let's go. It's already not going great. I can't even get the kicks in. Oh, I wanted to knock him out. Oh, this guy's almost done. Yeah! Sit your punk ass down, son. What's up? Shenmue Master right here. Fuck a safe scum. Tiger Spirit. So that's it? That's the last I can do? There's no more fighting to be done at the Rose Garden? Let's check out some of those moves. If I can actually select them on here. What the fuck is going on with this? This is really weird. Wow, it's happening on the keyboard, too. I'm trying to scroll with my arrow keys right now, and this is all I can do. I can't actually select individual ones. You can keep going from the start. So you get to come back at, like, 6.30 and then choose to start over or something? I mean, I'd like to keep farming tokens here. And, you know, the snake power wouldn't hurt either. Let's see if I can have some better luck and roll it on top. Saikoroka. Domo, domo. What's the max? 1500? Sure. I'm feeling good. Totally beatable. Yeah. Felicitations, he says. <laughs> That's a hell of a translation. <laughs> no. Uh, I didn't do the fishing competition. I didn't know such a thing existed. And I only fished once in Bailu. And then... I fished once here earlier, which you saw on the stream. I don't know how to reinitiate this. Is it just waiting for 630? 
I'll try waiting till 6.30 and see what happens. Oh, there's the Chobuchan. <laughs> I did find him before. I have the worst memory in the world. If you're not familiar with me and my content, you will come to realize that I have the memory of a goldfish. So, sorry about that. Yeah, I think the fishing's fine for what it is. I just, uh, it's, it's not like overly complicated. You know, there is a little bit of nuance to it for sure. But I think it's probably beat by other fishing mini games and other games. And I think Yu Suzuki probably knows that. Um, do I have to come back tomorrow in order to do this again? Because it's not letting me do anything right now. Um... It's almost 7 o'clock. I'll tell you what, guys. It's a wee bit early. But well, let's head back to the hotel and do some more phone conversations. Yeah, that's what I've heard. That I'm very close to being done with the story. I just want to... <laughs> I just want these jeans. <laughs> Once I get the jeans, I'm gonna go finish the story. Lin Sheeling has a quest. Um, I'm not sure if I did any quest for her yet. Failed the wagon bus because the capsule toys are stupid. Look at all the blank pages in the request section. That's the last thing I did in Bailu, and then I guess I missed all those in Bailu. And then here's Niawu. Okay, yeah, that's that one. Yeah, I haven't done one for her. Should I go talk to her? The guy with the blood on his shirt has a quest. I don't like that guy. That guy's creepy as all hell, man. I don't trust that dude. I'll go try and talk to them tomorrow. I want to try and close out these phone calls tonight. ジョイカ。どう。ああ。ねえ、あんた、いつ香港へ帰ってくるの香港へ帰る。まさか帰ってこないつもりいや、そういうことじゃ。人の運も変えさないで。自分の気が済んだらまっすぐ日本に帰
せめて宮廷公園の前のさちょっとおしゃれな港がいいのかなら風海圏はえサムやラリーと戦った店だ<笑>いろいろ壊して迷惑かけたけど<笑>なんで喧嘩場所ばっかりなのよもういいからご飯はそうか That's so good. じゃあまた電話するうん期待しないで待ってるよ期待されても困るがもうあんたって<笑><笑>まあいい無理して怪我すんじゃないよああ気をつける That's really good. Um, I knew that Chopping Wood had like a new music track when you get an excellent one, and I really like both of the ones I've heard. But I'm not good enough to get like three very good ones in a row, so I don't think I've ever heard that. Maybe someday. <laughs> I'd like to hear that. I don't know how to how to get very like how to get consistent very good chops. I feel like I'm right in the middle and it doesn't count. Hi, Koshue, Doshino, here this. Fun maker. Ah, Gyoza. Ah, Chodo Yukata, this. They was the critter. Chodo Yukata. It died, Dosta. Saki, Bumbo Saikande. Irene Santo, Izumi Santo, Ishani, Gyoza, and Hanasio Stetan, this year. Irene to. 泉、wow. 何の話をしてたんだりょうさんと戦ってどっちがいい勝負をしたかってそれ女の子がする話題なのか二人とも自分の方がりょうさんを追い詰めたって譲らなくて<笑>追い詰めたってそれでどうなんですかりょうさんは俺そうですよアイリーンさんと泉さんどっちが強いと思いましたかああそうだな。Clearly a Zumi. I could say Fang Mei. <laughs> I kind of want to say Fang Mei. That's the funny answer. Izumi is the true answer. I'm going to say Fang Mei though. Irene も Izumi も確かに強かったけど。そうですよね。でも、ファン名も強かったな。うんうん。で、私。ああ。忘れたのか The frying pan. Bong. Ah, that time. But, 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 まあ、俺の親父の受け売りだけどなところで秀英さんや文部病の人たちは変わりないかはいみんないつも通りです真面目に一生懸命お勤めしてますそうかじゃあ秀英さんによろしく伝えてくれはっこのファン名に任せてくださいじゃあまた電話するよああ元気でな That was great. These conversations are so good. Wow.、Uh, the joke at the temple when Ryo says the cat reminds him of Fang Mei. Are you just talking about how he was thinking about the cat back in Dobuita in the first game? Tom, no money! そんな危険なことはしていないまあ少しはあるか No, ダメよ、リョウ望みが悲しむねどうして腹先が出てくるんだトモにはわかるよ望みきっとカナダでリョウとても心配してるねそ
そうなのかレオチャイナの旅行楽しんでるえいや俺は観光で来てるわけじゃそれはトムも知ってるよレオの旅はファーゼルことと関係あるねトムでもレオどんな時でも楽しむ気持ち忘れちゃダメね楽しむ気持ちレオチャイナの旅で楽しいことあったでしょああそうだなうん。I do love the scenery here That's a true answer 初めて見る外国の街や風景はやっぱり面白いと思う Yes トムも初めて日本に来た時とてもエキサイティングだったよ空論城でも今思えばめったにできない経験ができた実際にいる時はとてもそんな風には思えなかったけどないろんな経験たくさんするそれはジャニーの一番の楽しみねそうかもしれないなハッカソンでもいい経験ができたハッカソンああ昔親父が修行した村だ俺もそこへ行った寮のファーズが親父を知ってた人と会えたけどまだわからないことも多いやっぱり俺はまだ旅を続けなくちゃいけないんだ親父のためにレオそろそろ切るよまた話そうイエスいつでもトムは待ってるねじゃあなトムグッバイレオ See you Guys is it just me or are these conversations better than the regular ones Like I feel like they, they held back the best conversations for the Kickstarter rewards Tom's Japanese is funny. <laughs> and yeah, I know about... I remember the thing where Rio said she looks like a cat. I thought you were saying there was like a deeper joke there. Like he was referring to the cat from Shenmue 1. But yeah. And dude, I was so happy to see Ren too. Ren's my favorite character. You have no idea. Ren's my favorite character in anything ever, and I love him to death. I'm so happy he's in this game. I wish there was more of him so far. いいねさんりょうさんりょうさんですねああ元気かいねさんはいおかげさまでりょうさんはいかがです俺なら大丈夫だ心配ない家の方は変わりないかなはい最近はお客様が続いて少々賑にぎやかなんですよお客さんええ桜ヤマギシさん、ミシマさんのところのめぐみちゃん、めぐみ、それに外国の方まで。イネさん、みんなのことを聞かせてくれないかはい、ようございますよ。Dude! Oh, that's mean. I really want to hear about Yamagishi san, but I'm really curious who the foreign visitor was. I have to pick that, just out of curiosity. 外国の人ってはいえー、っと確かトムはもうアメリカに帰ったし港で一緒に働いてたとおっしゃる、really? マークさんという方ですマークがうちにはいリョウさんに何度も助けてもらったとわざわざお礼を言いに家まで来られてそうだったのかお国に帰られるとおっしゃっていましたそうかマークも国に帰ったのかリョウさんも Did he ever find his brother? <笑>早くとは申しませんがリョウさんもどうかご無事でお戻りくださいああじゃあイネさんまた電話するよええー、また元気な声を聞かせてくださいねああイネさんも元気で福さんにもよろしく言ってくれはいまたお電話をくださいねきっとですよあ,あ約束するよじゃあまたイネさん
Guys, this is making me emotional. Mark was at the house. Mark met Ine-san. All of these... These Kickstarter conversations are just full of, like, references to the previous games and, and like, catching up on the actual characters themselves. Like, it's such a trip down memory lane. Like, I, I love this so much. There's a temple in Shenmue 3 where Ryo sees a cat and says it reminds him of Fang Mei. Really? Oh, I don't think I saw that. And yes, they should do more forklift routes. I want that so bad. Alright, I guess we'll call Fuchs on, I guess. They misspelled Hazuki in the subtitles. どうした。ふくさん。ああ、いえ。すいませんりょうさん。せっかく中国から電話をくれたのに。どうしたんだ。元気ないぞ。何かあったのか。りょうさん。俺。ああ。振られたんです、あけみさんに。そ。そうか。
That's right, they know each other. They're like cousins. They're like cousins. まあ、子供の頃からの付き合いだからな。どうかしたのか。実はな。あいつと喧嘩をして俺は勝ったことがない。貴重がジョイにああ。まさか。ジョイはお前以上の憲法の使い手だったのか。いや。あいつ怒
そんなにはっきりと覚えているわけじゃないでもいろんなこと全部がつながっているような気がそのシェンファって人葉月君にとってすごく特別な人みたいね特別そうなのかきっとそうその人はどんな人なのどんなって年は俺たちの少し下だな16って言ってたかなうんそれでああそれでのぞみちょっと手伝ってくれるあお母さんが呼んでるそうかごめん後でまた電話くれるああまた電話するもっと葉月くんと話したいからわかったじゃあ And that's the last call to let me make. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, I'm writing these down so that、um, I'll know exactly which which options to pick for the last calls that I need to make. So, it, just because I might forget, you know.、Um, I figured there'd be a warning for the point of no return because Byler did the same thing. And,、um, Yeah, I'm not. I'm honestly not like super worried about me missing stuff in the first playthrough because I'm going to play this game a bunch of times. Not on stream, but I'm going to be playing this game for years. So, like, I'll see everything eventually. I'm really just, like, for people who are watching this as a let's play, I'm just trying to make it as complete as I can, you know? At least for, like, the stuff I consider to be important. The hairdresser quest and the tour guide quest? I don't think so. Is the tour guide that guy that's standing right outside the ferry? Because I,、uh, the ferry terminal? Because I did talk to him once, but he didn't have a quest for me. I'll go try and talk to him then. I gotta talk to him. I gotta talk to Lynn. The barber quest is that from.、Uh, what is it? What is it called? Stonecutter hair or something like that? You're welcome, Brownie. That's why I do this. Yeah. Hey, can you guys answer me this? When you're in combat, do you know if there's a way to switch which manual or, uh. Yeah, which manual setting you're on? Like, can I switch from M2 to M1 in the middle of combat? Because I feel like there should be a way to do that. But as it is right now, I, I think I have to come into the menu to swap which one's going to be usable during a fight. Oh, yeah, I know that I can do them manually, but I'm just asking if there's a way to swap which shortcuts I'm using in the middle of a fight. Between like M1, M2, M3. Change it before you fight. Okay. So you just gotta be mindful. You should have like a you should have a training list and then an actual fight list, which I now have. I just have to make sure I'm on the right one for whatever situation I'm walking into, I guess.
I don't even know if throws would really work in this combat system, honestly. Rather than like adding to this and in, in, uh, like including the throws, I'd rather they just replace it with the Virtual Fighter system of the old games. Because it's way better in my opinion. Which I don't think will actually happen in this game. This game's fine for what it is. Like, I wish the combat was better, but, like, it, it is what it is, you know? It gets the job done. For Shenmue 4, I really hope they go back to Virtua Fighter. And I, th I think that the reason that they changed it is because... I think that in the year 2019... Um... Yusuke didn't want people to have to do, like, complicated move inputs on a D-pad. Because Virtua Fighter doesn't really work with an analog stick, right? I mean, you could do it, but it wouldn't feel intuitive. So I think he wanted to invent a new system where you could do all of the complicated combo moves using just face buttons instead of directional inputs. Which I think was a noble endeavor. And I, I guess that could work in a Virtua Fighter style system. But they need to actually have the, the Virtua Fighter components in there. The moves have to have weight behind them. You have to be able to... Uh, like, showcase different fighting styles in your opponents. Like, I feel like everybody in this game fights the same way. It doesn't feel like anybody has a unique style. Like, in Shenmue 2, fighting Eileen and fighting Izumi were two very different things. They felt completely different. And I don't get that sense from this game. Virtua Fighter is owned by Sega, but, I mean, Sega lets Yu Suzuki use the Shenmue license. Why can't he also use the Virtua Fighter license? You know what I'm saying? I think you could use the Virtua Fighter system with, with the level up system. I think that would work fine. In fact, I think the level up system in this game is great. Like, they did a really good job with it. But that also, that makes it, like, kind of suck even more that the fighting's not that satisfying, because you level up, but then in practicality, when you go to use it, you're like, oh, I don't... It doesn't really feel like I got a tangible reward for training. You know, like, in the first two games, when you level up a move and they actually change forms and become more powerful, they don't seem to do that in this game. Like, they get more powerful, but they don't change forms. It doesn't change the property of the move, you know? すいません。何かお困りですか？観光でしたらお任せを。私は長部観光の案内をしているものです。聞きたいことが対岸の古城へ行く方法を知りませんか？難しい質問ですね。あそこは観光客を受け入れていないものですから。そうですか。This guy doesn't seem to have a quest. I can't ask him about that. Uh, what do you mean he didn't get the rights from Sega? I mean, he didn't buy the rights, but he got the permission from them to use the Shenmue copyright. And obviously they're getting a kickback from it, you know? Alright, so I'm gonna go and try and talk to Lin. Yeah, he got the Shenmue only license, but what I'm saying is, if, if he's able to use the Shenmue license, why can't he also use the Virtua Fighter license, which is kind of, you know, intrinsically linked to Shenmue? I mean, if, if they want him to make a good, successful Shenmue game, and they're already letting him use the Shenmue license, what would be so bad about giving him the Virtua Fighter license as well? Just <laughs> Ah, 
あまあそうだなシリンには黙っておくかはい何か言いましたいや何でもないんだじゃあまたな Yeah, sadly, guys, I think it's maybe too late in the game for some of these side quests. They don't seem to be doable anymore. And yeah, I, I understand that they didn't give him that license. I'm, I'm saying they should. <laughs> And yeah, it might cost too much money to do like a really deep, complex fighting system like Virtua Fighter, but I don't know. I would hope that like with Shenmue 4, he gets more funding. And I don't think Shenmue 3 sales are doing great, just based on preliminary reports from like Japan. Apparently, it didn't do great there, which sucks a lot. So, you know, Shenmue 4 seems like it's going to be kind of dependent on how good Shenmue 3 does. And I think maybe that's not going to turn out so well. I hate to say it. But, you know. If, if we're doing a,、uh, a Shenmue 4 dream wish list, you know, they can keep it looking exactly the same as this. I think these graphics are fine. It's not going to win any, like, awards for best looking game, but it, it looks great for what it is. They can keep everything else exactly the same. Just get some Virtua Fighter fighting in there. This, this would be like a. This would be a practically perfect Shenmue game. Not a perfect game, a perfect Shenmue game, if they just did that. I agree, the, the environments in this game look amazing. Rose Garden no champion, Hazuki Ryo ga kita zo! Eh? Champion? So, ste, minna m i t e g r e ここのの超物最強のチャンンピオンに挑もうってつわものが大集合だなあチャンピオン It's all the warehouse dudes. 俺のことかああそうだよまたファイトしに来たんだろ今回からはいつもの勝ち抜き戦だけじゃねえぞあんたのためにエキシビジョンマッチを用意したんだエキシビジョンああ準備ができたら声をかけてくれよああしかし、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、ああ、あ勝ったらファイトマネーを払ってやるよ。対戦相手が誰になるかはお楽しみだ。おっと、早速挑戦者が名乗りを上げたぜ。その名も、ケイリンの銀狼、ジョーケンチが来た。見ろ、獲物に植えたこの鋭い目。逃げられる奴はいるのか。どうだいチャンピオン、こいつと戦ってみねえか。みんなあんたの戦いぶりを見たくてうずうずしてんだぜさあどうだエントリーフィーはこれだ200チャンプチェンジコンやってみるかあ、we're going back through the duans again 少しはできそうだな Alright, I'm still on my training moves, but that's okay. <laughs> I don't think these fights are gonna be that tough. Alright, Alright, 
これだやってみるか Should I be doing this or should I be doing the tournament option? おい、おい。誰だこんなやばい<笑> We gotta be raising the stakes here. Yes. Come on. Yeah, no. 200 is nothing. That's pretty good. All right, all right. ハハハ。せえ。みよ、これせる。ダメね。せ。ああ。さすがだな、チャンピオン。客も大喜びだぜ。よし、兄さんの取り分だ。ほらよ。おっと。今度は別の奴が兄さんに挑戦したがってるぜ。どうだい？気をつけろ、気をつけろ。最強の足技師の登場だ。I'm just trading tokens for money during these fights. リーサンダー。華麗なその技に見とれてると一発で天国行きだぜ。エントリーフィーはこれだ。This guy's second bomb, but it still costs the same amount of tokens. Okay, well, this isn't doing anything for me. I need to see what the tournament option is. エントリーフィーはこれだ。やめておくよ。なんだよ。がっかりさせんなよ。なんだよ。待ってんだからさ。次はリングに上がってくれよな。Okay, let's see if it fix this yet. It sure didn't. I sure would love to look at some of these new moves I picked up. <laughs> But I can't. Um, yeah, let me go back to this one for whatever this tournament option is going to be. Yoshita, Katsunuki sent a na. Each day, go to ni entry fee o kakete yaru shiai da. Kateba nisan no toribun wa nibai da. Sono namo. Silver Wolf of Guilin. 
逃げられるやつはいるのかどうだいチャンピオンこいつと戦ってみねえかみんなあんたの戦いぶりを見たくてうずうずしてんだぜさあどうだエントリーフィーはこれだ Still just 200? やってみるか It should go up with each successive fight. That's what would make sense to me. I hit two buttons in that entire fight. Three, if you count the buttons to switch <laughs> to the other attack. <laughs> oh, Oh, thank God it's going up. Okay. Yes. You haven't had any bugs on PS4? That's good. I guess PS4 is like a more stable development platform, I guess. I haven't had too many bugs. The, the most problems I've had came from using a, a brand new Xbox One controller. Something about the Bluetooth connection there was really screwing up the game, it seems like. I still haven't figured it out completely. <laughs> Quit cutting me off, a hole. Anthony Perez. All right, let's, yes. keep, let's keep going yeah, down this road here. I like this. Anthony, this guy's name is Anthony. He's Tony. He's Tony from Shenmue 1. I've already kicked this guy's ass like eight times though. I how to do the, the windmill kick. I thought it was XBB. Oh. That was brutal. Okay, not only is she cute, but she's also a legit fighter. From Muren Cafe, the Azure Queen B. Oh, it's this girl. I remember her. She's got kind of a Chun Li thing going on. Whatever you just said, they didn't bother to subtitle it, so. She probably said something like, I won't go easy on you, or like, don't underestimate me just because I'm a girl. <laughs> just because you're a girl doesn't mean you won't get the old spinning back fist. Remember that shit. That shinbone smash is pretty good. <laughs> Smart Samchai. 
Muay Thai skills. Yikes. I don't think solid sales, sales figures have been released in totality. I, they did release um, like charts for Japan, and I think Shenmue 3 sold. It was like the, the ninth best selling game or something in Japan. But I don't know if there's like actual hard data out there. Wow, this dude hits hard. Okay. Mockfist Chris Bellinger. So far, this has all been very doable. This guy's name should have Smith in it. That would complete the joke. I don't know why they didn't do that. Let's do it. Maybe Smith's first name is Chris, and I just never knew that. That could be the case. Oh, so for a ring out there. Look at him trying to dodge me like he's fucking Neo. Alright. That's not a bear, folks. Great benevolent bear, Shilie Tai. I wish this was going up faster. Oh, my controller died! Shit! Ah. <laughs> oh, that was close. Hey, guys, give me a second. I need to get more batteries. Yes, no Toribunda. All right. Otto! Luckily, I keep a stash close by. Unfortunately, they're wrapped up super tight. Seriously, this wrapper's like glued on here. Jesus. Okay.
Okay, brand new fresh batteries. Sorry about that. Entry fee wa kore da. Yatte miru ka. You know someone for whom this is their first Shenmue game and she's loving it? That is awesome. Keep spreading the love, man. That's the way the franchise stays alive, is that we just bring in new fans. Who are willing to support it financially. That's what it takes. Oh, I just remembered how to do some certain moves that I really like. Even if they're maybe not the most effective moves. <laughs> おっと。Knife Duan. Sooner or later, I'm going to start losing these fights. Because these guys are just getting tougher. Oh, see the Shinbone Smash miss there. I'll stick to the lawnmower. Ooh, but that knocked him over straight up. That was cool. All right, that that was cool. <laughs> Killer style learned in Bailu, deeper than Guilin. Chen Mulin. Yeah, I know what you mean, Philip. The QTs in this game are super fast. But at least there's usually not a penalty for failing them. You just really get to just try it again right away. So, I, I think it's fine. I actually kind of wish that there were more fail states. I wish that, you know, you could fail some and it would play out a little differently, but you could still keep going, like in the old games. See ya, bitch. I will never take it easy. I will destroy all of my enemies. Buffalo Baron. And everything. Oh, geez, that was close. I, he almost had me down there. 
This guy is like an unlimited block meter. Yeah, the duck catching can be challenging. I haven't actually failed that yet, though. It, you still get paid, even, even if you don't get all 20 of them, right? Like, you just don't get paid as much, I would assume. Jeez, all right. I might lose this one. I'm not even going to use the snake power. This guy's kicking my ass. Freaking blocks everything and then does like three orbs worth of damage. I might have been able to beat him if I had used like all my snake power, but that stuff is expensive. So I'm just gonna cut my losses on that. And we're gonna go cash in these chips that we've won. And we're gonna see how much money that gives us. I'm, I'm homing in on the final stage of the game, guys. Like, uh... I, I don't seem able to do any of the side quests that you guys have told me about. I have more than enough kung fu moves now. Like, I still would like to see more, but... I don't think it's really gonna make for an entertaining watch for you guys to watch me, like, grind out all these prize sets for the kung fu moves. And I mean... You know, I'm not gonna get them all trained up in time anyway, so, like, whatever. I think, really, I just need to buy the jeans, and then I wanna do the rest of the phone calls, and then I think it's gonna be time to head to Ren and play the last hour of the game, guys. But I don't think I'm gonna be able to do that tonight. I think we'll do that tomorrow. We'll do like, we'll finish out the second round of phone calls tonight and then we'll do the third round tomorrow and then finish the game. That's my plan for right now. Last thing I did in the main story is uh, Shenhua has been kidnapped. And I know that she's being held in the castle across the way. Uh, Ren stole the fake Phoenix mirror and has a plan to trade it for Shenhua. So I have to go meet Ren. And then we're going to go find a boat and go save Shenhua. How many corundums can I buy here? Dozo! Gehin Kokan, Kotira desio! Oh, I love that I can actually make that lady shut up. <laughs> I can only get three. This isn't gonna be enough. Son of a bitch. I have not found a boat yet. Kotira desne! Mata no. But I was told earlier that there's only about an hour of real story left, which I already kind of assumed. Just from things other people have told me and stuff that I've gleaned, I know that we're pretty close to the end. And I gotta tell you, I've been playing this game for how many hours now? And it still feels too short to me. This game could probably be 80 hours long and I'd still feel like it was too short. But that's just life. 
That's life as a Shenmue fan. <laughs> Things are fleeting. Oh no. Oh, never mind. This is working. Okay. Uh, I got dumb for a second there. 9,163. That's just a little too short for the jeans, right? How much were they? 9,000 something? Yeah, totally, Phil. This is just my first playthrough. I'm going to be doing a lot more playthroughs that I'm not streaming, just, you know, on my personal time when I'm done with this. I apologize to viewers for the things that I have missed during this playthrough. I mean, it's, it's a blind let's play. It's not like one and two where I knew everything, you know? <laughs> and again, I'll say that just because I finish this here doesn't mean I'm necessarily done streaming Shenmue 3. It, it, I'll, I'll be done for now. Hi, hi. Uh, but there's going to be DLC, and I might just stream it sometimes for fun, try and show off like other side quests and stuff that I find. Wait. Am I a complete idiot? Didn't this say 9,000 before? To buy these jeans? What was I looking at? These are only $967? Hi, my daddy. Guys, I've been playing this game for the last, like, three hours operating under the assumption that I needed $9,000 to buy those jeans. The prices keep changing? Does it change that much? Does it go from $9,000 to $900? And why does it change? I'm so confused. You have no idea how confused I am right now. I still can't scroll through those properly, so that's cool. Well, we got our ripped jeans now. <laughs> I, I don't know what happened there, guys. Either the price changed that much, or I read it wrong, and nobody else caught it either, and... I don't know. Oh, that does look cool, though, doesn't it? It looks like he's been through the ringer, man. It looks like I just spend all my time fighting. That's dope. That's really dope. Okay, um... I think I've got all the moves that I care about maxed out. Did I get... Oh, I, I do want to max out... Oh, I did... A, I have Chain Fist maxed out. I just don't have the actual ability to swap it out right now. Because the game's bugged or something. I don't know. So I'll have to try to remember to swap that out when I load it up next time. Yeah, they're, they're great jeans, aren't they, Brownie? That was a good call. I like these jeans, too. Okay, so here's what I'm going to do. Uh, we're really close to maxing out Rooster Steps, so I'm just going to knock this out real quick. Kehoka. I think this will max out our endurance and we'll literally have as much health as we can possibly have. And then, I mean, since I've got like $8,000 to spend on whatever the hell I want now, <laughs> we can have some fun spending money before we close out the game. I don't know, is there anything... Are there any, like, articles of clothing you guys want to see? Are there any, like, arcade games you'd like me to play some more? 
Anything like that. Anything we can spend money on for fun. Am I going to continue the Chobuchan hunt in a new game? Yeah. I would, I would like to find all of them. Like, personally for myself. I don't know if there's really value in hunting down all of them here on the live stream. I mean, I've already found a lot of them. You'd like to see the black jeans? That would be cool. I just have to figure out where they are. I have no idea where to find them. Black jeans are an arcade prize. So you have to get get a certain high score in a certain arcade game. They're a prize at the prize exchange? I thought I looked in there and I didn't see them. Or is... Oh, there's... I was looking at the other prize exchange. I get what you're saying now. Yeah, okay, I'll go check there. As soon as I'm done with this. right? Okay, good. That makes it simple. That's way easier than trying to flag down some random clothing shop. <laughs> Although there's two different arcades that have prize exchanges, I think, so I'll have to check both of them. It'd be a good idea to look anyway, because I haven't checked those prize exchanges in quite a while, so... I kind of want to see one of those one of those shiny jackets. Like, I don't think I'll actually wear it. I just want to see what it looks like on him, you know? Can you tell me a secret that you don't think is a spoiler? If you're positive that it's not a spoiler, then yes, you can say it. Please use your discretion. I'm gonna trust you. Go ahead and tell me. There are two Chobuchans in both arcades. Really? Two of them? That That is actually good to know, because I probably would have never discovered that on my own. You're just talking about the big arcades, right? That sucks that I couldn't max that out on that run. We're very close. There it is. Let's see what happens if I fail this now. 
if I just don't do it. Nothing? There's no fail state for that? Okay. Yeah, that, that's cool. I do really enjoy looking for the Chobuchans. And I'm not sure how many I have left in this playthrough, honestly. If anything, so that's probably the one thing I'll do. I'm going to keep a separate save file for before we leave here. And I'll load that up and uh, maybe do some Chobuchan hunting in like a special Chobuchan stream. That might be fun. But I'm at a point where I, I don't feel like I can squeeze the rest of that into this playthrough. Max Endurance! We did it, guys. That's training right there. Gone. Practice every day without neglect. Yeah. And you too will have a max endurance bar. <laughs> cool. Get out of the way, kid. There's grown ups trying to hang out in this arcade. Yeah, like that Whack-A-Mole game. I only played that one time, but that was fun. It's it's basically just another version of QTE title, but it's like a silly fun version of it, you know? <laughs> All right, let's see what we got here. Is that them? Black jeans, there they are. 6,400 tokens. I should be able to buy that with the money I've got now. What else is in here, by the way? Oh, I should just, like... I should max out on black garlic, too. And... It's a special phone card. I don't, I don't think I need that one. Red crystal... I'm just trying to see, trying to remember if I need any of these items. Ceramic pot? Do I need that? No, I need a, a cauldron. That's different. Okay, so we're going to go get 6,400 tokens. We're going to get a shitload of tokens, and we're going to buy the jeans, and we're going to buy a whole bunch of black garlic. So that I can restore myself when I need to. Also, I forgot about these lucky hit boards up here. Are these just money lucky hits? They're not actually prizes. Times two, times three, times three. That's right, these kind of suck. Look at this, this is one winning spot and it's only a times three. Get the hell out of here with that. Joking me, son? Ano... I don't think we were able to give Shenhua that present, Brownie. If we were, the game never indicated that to me in any way. So I don't think that was a thing. Um, yeah, 20,000 tokens is fine. Which does make me kind of mad. Because the game went out of its way to say that. Like, oh, maybe you could give this to that girl you like. Cool. And I was like, yeah, I really want to do that. Maybe it happens at the end of the game. <laughs> maybe. Probably not. Okay. Let's look at some of these other t-shirts while we're in here, too. Oh, it's classic Shenmue art right there. There's... There is a surprising number of different t-shirts to wear in this game. Oh, the Ren shirt. Yes. And Guizong. That's so cool. Alright. That. And then... So much garlic, guys. I feel like I'm turtle racing right now. <laughs> you can't give her the amulet, but she shows you the one her father gave her. When did she do that? Is that... A... 
like a special cutscene you get somewhere? Is it the end of the game or? Okay, let's get outside where we have some lighting. In Bailu. She shows you the one her father gave her. Did I? Did I see that? <laughs> Brownie, did I see that? You remember better than I do. A nighttime conversation at her house. I'm not sure if I got all those conversations. I really hope I did. Whoa, whoops, that's not right. Black jeans. I don't think that looks bad. I think that actually looks really good with that jacket. I think that goes really well together. What do you guys think? Rip jeans or black jeans for the end of the game? She did it in Bailu, and it was the same material which made us think we could give that to her. Oh, okay. I gotta tell you guys, I, I'm kind of leaning towards these black jeans. I think that looks really, really good. It's funny, because I spent all this time grinding stuff out to get the ripped jeans. <laughs> But I think I like these more. Everybody likes those better than the torn up jeans. All right, it has been decided. I agree. Black jeans, Yokosuka jacket, that's what's up. All right, we're gonna go through this. We're gonna finish the second round of these special phone calls, guys. We left off with uh, Nozomi, didn't we? So time for Goro. みんな元気か。はい。俺ももいも魚姉さんもみんな元気に真面目にやってますよ。そうか。時々みんなで兄貴の話をしてるんですよ。今頃どうしてるかなって。そうか。俺なら元気だ。みんなに相伝えてくれ
ジョイかリョウああねえあんたいつ香港へ帰ってくるの香港へ帰るまさか帰ってこないつもりいやそういうことじゃ人の恩も返さないで自分の気が済んだらまっすぐ日本に帰ろうって気いやだから先をどうするかなんて今は考えられないんだそれに人の恩ってなんだあのねあたいがあんたにどれほどよくしてあげたと思ってるのよえまあそれは世話になったとは思ってるよでしょじゃあ何をお返ししてくれるのかなちょっと楽しみおおいジョイ何何をしてくれるのそそれは I don't know what he means by teach technique, like martial arts. That's probably a funny one, so let's save that for last. Nanika Hoshimono Aruka. Nanio Kuni. Present to cry, or that the sru. So Nanda Nanigai. So ne Are ni shio cono. Are? Ah, the Mareva Tsigini Totoite. やっぱりあっちかな次ってなんだあっちってうーん迷うなジョイ、What? 決めないなら俺が勝手に選んで香港へ戻ったら渡すいいなえちょ何にするかなあ仏像とかはい坪屋もあったな照明屋も坪照明何よそれいらないかそんなのもらって喜ぶ女がいると思ってんのいやかじゃあ骨董品はもういらないじゃあまた電話するうん期待しないで待ってるよ期待されても困るがもうあんたって<笑>まあいい無理して怪我すんじゃないよああ気をつける Listen to Joy getting all uppity. You're not gonna buy me the right present.、Mm. Alright, Bang Mei, one of my favorites. She's so cute and funny and terrifying with a frying pan. I'm glad you're enjoying it, Philip. I'm happy that I can share this with you guys too. This is really. Really cool. Hi, Ko Shue, Rosh no hair this. Fun maker. Ah, Ryosa. Ah, Chodo Yukata des. Tell us the credit. Chodo Yukata. It I dosta. Saki, Bumbo Saikande. Irene Santo Izumi Santo Ishani. Ryosa no Hanasio Stetan des. Irene to Izumi? None no Hanasio Stetanda. Ryosa to Tatakate. Dotiga Isho Vosta. それ、女の子がする話題なのか二人とも自分の方がりょうさんを追い詰めたって譲らなくて追い詰めたってそれでどうなんですかりょうさんは俺そうですよアイリーンさんと泉さんどっちが強いと思いましたかああそうだな So Izumi is by far the correct answer here so I'm gonna save that one for last あえて言うならアイリーンかなそうなんですねああアイリーンの憲法はしなやかに見えて強烈な一撃を放つんだ俺も苦戦したよふむふむ苦戦したとアイリーンさんに言っておきますねおい苦戦したってアイリーンに言うのか<笑>えっ言おうですか対戦相手にそういうのはちょっと悔しい気がするなああまあ昔からそうなんだでもそういうところ好きですそうかえところで秀英さんや文部病の人たちは変わりないか That was awkward, wasn't it? <笑>、はい、みんないつも通りです真面目に一生懸命お勤めしてますそうかじゃあ秀英さんによろしく伝えてくれ
また電話するよはいりょうさんもお元気で私はここでずーっと帰りを待ってますからねああ元気でなクオ That one was kind of a weird one. It felt awkward to me. Tom! <laughs> Tom's Japanese voice is the best. And I, I don't think it's the same guy as the original game, but I think they both did a really good job. Because he sounds really similar. Hello? Tom. ああ、元気かトムもちろん元気いっぱいねレオはどうデンジャレスなことしちゃダメよそんな危険なことはしていないまあ少しはあるかノーダメよレオ望みが悲しむねどうして腹先が出てくるんだトムにはわかるよ望みきっとカナダでレオをとっても心配してるねそそうなのかレオチャイナの旅行楽しんでるえいや俺は観光で来てるわけじゃそれはトムも知ってるよレオの旅はファーゼルことと関係あるねトムでもレオどんな時でも楽しむ気持ち忘れちゃダメね楽しむ気持ちリョウチャイナの旅で楽しいことあったでしょああそうだな<笑> It's not really a trip meant for fun、uh, We'll save people for last 中国へ来ていろんな憲法を学ぶことができたそれは楽しかったと思うよ Chinese martial arts <笑>ああ中国だけじゃないモンゴルやロシア世界中の武術家と試合もしたんだ。わお、それはグレートね。おかげで俺も少しは腕を上げたかもしれない。でも技を学んだだけじゃない。もっと大事なことも分かったんだ。大事なことああ、仲間のため、誰かのために戦うというのはとても強い気持ちになれる。イエス、それはきっと勇気ね。勇気。そうだなきっとあの時の親父も俺を守るためにレオそろそろ切るよまた話そう。じゃあなトム。ごばいでよ。せよ。あっばいトム。あっばいトム。あっばいトム。Oh, time for more Ine san. I love these calls with Ine san, but they also just make me want to cry. I feel so bad for her. Guys, if you have grandmas or great grandmas, go give them a call. And grandpas, too. Hi. Hazuki Bukan de Gozaimas. Ine san. Lio san. Lio san d e s n e Ah. 元気かイネさんはいおかげさまでりょうさんはいかがです俺なら大丈夫だ心配ない家の方は変わりないかなはい最近はお客様が続いて少々賑にぎやかなんですよお客さんええ桜ヶ丘の山岸さんに三島さんのところのめぐみちゃんそれに外国の方まで。イネさん、みんなのことを聞かせてくれないか。はい。ようございますよ。Okay。We gotta save Yamagishi san for last because he's the one I care about the most, like for sure。めぐみちゃんって三島のはい。かわいい猫ちゃんを連れてきたんですよ。あの神社にいた猫か。Oh, wow. 猫がすっかり大きくなったと言って。りょうさんに見せに来てくれたんですけどりょうさんが遠くに行ってしまったと聞いてがっかりしていましたよそうだったのかでもあの猫も元気に育ったのならよかった何でもあ
の日に親猫が車にひかれて死んでしまったとかああそうなんだだから俺も放っておけなくてな随分面倒を見てあげたそうですねめぐみちゃんが言っていましたよ<笑>俺はそうでもないさ稲にはわかりますよりょうさんはお優しい人ですからじゃあ稲さんまた電話するよええー、また元気な声を聞かせてくださいねああ稲さんも元気で福さんにもよろしく言ってくれはいまたお電話をくださいねきっとですよああ約束するよじゃあまた She just sits around and waits for us to call, guys. Oh, God.、Uh, so that's canonical confirmation that the cat is alive and well. We took care of it. Even though this game does not have any、uh, you know, connection to our original game saves, we still took care of the cat. <laughs> All right, last one for tonight, guys. Here's Buksan. Good man, Philip. You should talk to your mom all the time. Unless your mom's just like a really bad person or something. Hi, Hazuki Bukan. This is Hook San. Ah, Joe San. This is Dosh. Hook San. Ah, yeah. Say, my son, Joe San. Say, Cock, Chung, Cock, 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 元気ないぞ何かあったのかりょうさん俺振られたんですあけみさんにそそうか当分立ち直れそうにないです俺福さんなあ福さん俺はまだよくわからないけどそういう時は Do you guys remember a Kimi san? She was that really weird girl who hung out at the bar. Uh, Bar Yukoska with Saijo san all the time. Um, uh, let's save travel for last, I guess. So you took your Keiko da. Lio san. Mushin de Keiko ste. Aseo nagaste skiri suru no ga ito mo. Keiko deska? Ah, so da. Suguni dojo de. So dramatic. Huh? So, 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 そんな時が来るのかその時にはこの俺がりょうさんを励ましてあげますからねそうかあありがとうふくさん話は変わるんだけどはい何ですか稲さんはいるかな稲さんなら今は買い物に出かけてますけどそうかじゃあかけ直すよそうですかじゃあまたな福さん。That ending always feels weird because you always just talk to Ine san right before. It's like, I know she's not out shopping, don't lie to me. 今はやめておくか。Like, I feel like they could have come up with something a little better for that, but yeah. All right. Well, that's, that's the home stretch, guys. Um. We are just about hitting the four hour mark here. And I'm about spent for tonight. It's pretty late. So, I'm gonna wrap this up. We're gonna come back tomorrow. And we're going to finish Shenmue 3.、Um, unless I think of something else that I really desperately wanna do on stream, we're just gonna do the last round of the phone calls. And then we'll head straight to Ren. Play the rest of the game.、Um, I'm hoping to start around 6 p.m. Mountain Standard Time tomorrow. 
So whatever time that is for you. If you would like to see the ending of Shenmue 3, figure out the time. Come check out the stream. Thank you, Philip. Uh, you know what? Thank you, Philip, Brownie, everybody else who hung out here tonight. I sincerely had a great time on the stream tonight. I had so much fun. This was a blast. And I appreciate you guys sharing this experience with me. Look at all these freaking save files I've got. <laughs> this is just absurd. So I'm going to make a, f a fresh save right here at the top of the list. And then we'll use that. Uh, for like future streams if we want to do Chobuchan hunting and whatnot. Um, but yeah, tomorrow we're going to wrap this up. So, yeah, again, thank you guys very much. I sincerely had a blast tonight. I had a, I had a ton of fun. This is great. And I hope to see you guys when we finish the game tomorrow. So everybody have a good night, and I'll see you then. Take care. <laughs>